just perfect even me hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for clicking um, i love you guys so 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 much my cat wants to say hi wolf what up what's up wolf so i have decided to do a diy video i hope you guys like it this is my first diy ever but many will follow hopefully what i am using for this diy video is um gold spray i got this gold spray on jumia for was it 450 or if you like this video please just show me some love give it a thumbs up and uh make sure you subscribe is it here or here yes and hit the bell symbol so that you can be getting notifications every time i upload a video so let's get started I got this the last time I bought juice from Creamy Inn. So I'm just gonna seal it with cello tape so that it doesn't drip. Mix some cement and water, then fill it up. Then I'm going to take a dry branch and put it inside. The next morning, this is what it looks like. Just relax, I'm not done yet. <laughs> so I'm gonna remove this, which shouldn't be so hard. Look at that, that is so smooth. So I'm going to use this sandpaper to smoothen out the parts that are not so smooth. So now after that, it's time to spray paint. Finally, this is what you should have. Dope, right? It looks so expensive. What do you think? Leave a comment. Let me know. Next, you have a biro. This is about 10 shillings in a shop near you. So you're going to remove this thing inside. Make it empty from both ends. Then crack it up. Just make it a little bit shorter. Then you're going to have to cut this thing. So that you can make room for the feather. Then finally, you're going to put the feather inside. I had actually uh, spray painted this feather last night. Then now we're going to um, use cello tape to stick them together. You know, just make it stable. Finally, spray paint. Oh my gosh, look at what it looks like. Finally, so cute. For this next one, you're going to need straws. When you're buying straws, just make sure you buy the ones that don't have these papers because it was such a process removing the papers. What you're going to do is cut these straws into halves and then into another half. You will need something like this from a box, for example. And they're going to draw a circle, so you're going to shape it in form of a circle. After that, it is time to stick on the straws. So I'm using super glue. I'm just gonna stick them on one by one. Put the longest straws first, and then the short straws, which are like halfway second, and then the shorter ones. This doesn't look cute, right? Wait till I spray paint. <laughs> Look at that. This is dope. And once you're done, it should look like this. Wow. Finally. Okay, not finally. I'm, I'm not even halfway done. I got this at Masai Market. And I thought they'd look dope if I spray painted them. And so I did. I, I should let you know I do not regret it one bit. I got this from my brother um i think it's really really cute and it would look even better when you have spray painted it i'm just crazy about golden spray paint this is like my favorite thing right now next i thought i would spray paint this 
in the compound so i'm just gonna clean it up then spray paint oh my gosh this is so much fun and after you're done you should have something that looks like this nice I have an idea of spray painting this Nescafe tin as well um, and making it my pencil holder in my office. By the way, if you guys want an office tour, please leave a comment below. Let me know and I'll do it. So I basically just removed the wrap that was on top of it, cleaned it up and spray painted it. I let it dry for about 10 minutes then i gave it the second coat look at this cute thing what it is so cute i have to make it even cuter by spray painting it so i'm just gonna cover up the plant with this paper just to protect it from the spray paint and i'm gonna do my thing I feel like golden spray paint gives things more life, makes them look expensive and unique. I'd recommend this if you have things in your house that are old, just spray paint them and you will love the result. You know that color has the ability to change your mood. Therefore, spray painting small things like scissors that you use almost every day in the house or in the office can actually give you morale while working. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. Next, we had actually thrown this lampshade. That was before I came up with a genius idea of spray painting it. So you might have things in the house that, you know, like have rust on them and things like that. But once you spray paint them, it changes the whole look of your house. So that's what I did with this lampshade. So after cleaning it up, I spray painted it. Then I let it dry for about 15 minutes and I gave it the second coat. Wow, look at that. Some of these DIYs were inspired by other YouTube videos whose link I will leave in the description. That marks the end of my video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please just show me some love. Give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Also leave a comment. Let me know what you think about these DIY ideas that I've given you. Which one you think is your favorite and why? Also, let me know which other video you'd want me to work on next. <laughs> I love you guys so, 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 so much. Bye-bye.